Spartans fighting back. Spartans trying to fight back. Hey, you lost, pal. Time to pay up. Oh. Completely unprotected shot to the jaw. He's out. He's not kissing anything. He's unconscious. You're rubbing an unconscious man's face against your foot. You know what, Joe? I agree with you. When he wakes up, he deserves to give King Rob Love a proper kiss on the foot. If the king would have liked him. There you saw it, folks. What led us to this moment here on RCW Bushwhacker. the professor jesse james oh and here comes the man who will be challenging for the rcw championship later on on this broadcast king rob love will be taking on mysterious q and we should oh. mention that jesse james is sponsored by jose and gloria torres of torres irrigation give him a call for all your irrigation needs 210-993-1327 or email them at jt28344 at gmail.com and the king taking in the love from his royal subject ringside here at rcw and boy do we have a treat the king oh, is oh, joining us the king's joining us on commentary oh boy oh Thanks. what an oh, honor be great. what an honor oh. king rob love let me get this guy set up Oh my God! This is gonna be oh, such this a is this, this is one of the joys of being a color commentator for RCW. Uh huh. Uh oh. oh and Smart guy. Rob Love was about to join us in commentary, but immediately got up to let Luis Martin Ramirez know who's boss. And here you go, sir. Here you go. Phantom Javi adorning. Well, thank you very much. Now. Can you hear me? Absolutely, sir. What, 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 what that look on your face? Look at my face? Yeah. The look at my face is I can't believe I have to sit here next to a person who's absolutely you should be. You should be absolutely honored. You should be absolutely oh honored to be joined on commentary by His Royal Highness, King Rob Love. The only disappointment should be that I have the best seat in the house. I get to sit right next to the king and be his right hand man. So thank you. I appreciate that. What you should do over there is kiss my foot like Spartan did. Let you me didn't even do that. Let me you you should you're, you're absolutely right. Man you're absolutely on right. Your foot. And I have some clarification oh Hold after on. Carolina yeah. Teague gets us started. Ladies and gentlemen, to my left. From the Cumai, weighing in at 180 pounds, give it up for Jeff E. James. There we go. There we go. That's right. Even the king. That's and right. His opponent, Supportive. To my right, from Spartanburg, Texas, weighing in at 173 pounds, give it up for Luis Spartan Ramirez. Let me ask you this, King. To me, Luis Ramirez still owes you a kiss on the foot because he was unconscious when he was supposedly delivered that kiss. And I didn't see any puckering up. I didn't hear anything. He just kind of rubbed his face on your foot. To me, you're still owed a kiss on the foot from I the Spartan. 100% agree with that. You know, he said he's a man of his word. He went against his word. He didn't kiss my foot. He lost fair and square in that match. You saw it. Look at you. What's the matter over there, Joe? You clocked him on the jaw when rightfully he disrespected you in the ring by refusing to adhere to the conditions of the match. What a, what a sore loser. Big sore loser. It's not my fault he fainted in the middle of the match. That's what happened, right? I'm that, not going to I mean, that's that's tell them this revisionist history here, especially when we have two incredible athletes. I will teach you history. The, the, your regal lineage here? Exactly. Being a king. And what's going to happen is Spartan's going to owe me that kiss on the foot. He's going to deliver one day. And you might be he on could. the list. Absolutely. Well, 
I'm not going to focus on the past. Let's focus on the future. Let's focus on what's happening with you tonight, challenging Mysterious Q for the RCW Championship. He's going to be a king in more ways than one at the end of the night. That's right, because I'm going to be crowned the new RCW Champion. I'm going to take down arguably one of the greatest men to hold the RCW Championship. I'm taking him down tonight. And so how are you going to take him down with a brass knucks? You're going to bring a chair, a flamethrower, a tank? Like, what, what's your plan? I would never do anything like that. Mm -hmm. What are you talking about? I'm going to win fair and square like I always do. And look at this. Speaking of fair and square, look at these kicks. Just chopping them down. The professor, Jesse James, an incredible practitioner of several disciplines of mixed martial arts. Dominant early on, as he should be, under the tutelage of King Rob Love. Now you, now you gotta watch Spartan. You see, he might have pulled the hair on that arm drag a little bit. Look at him, he's cheating already. A clean scoop and a slam from the Spartan. Into the cover. Lateral press, two count. That's a fast count, if you ask me. No one did. I wouldn't I wouldn't put any malfeasance past the Spartan after basically cheating King Rob Love out of delivering that kiss on the foot last time we were here in San Antonio at the Grand Event Center. But you know what? Jesse James is going to make him pay tonight. He's going to pay the price tonight. I guarantee you. Mark my words. That's a guarantee. Spartan's going to pay tonight. Look at that. He's already paying. He's busting his ribs up. See, it makes it hard to breathe, Joe, when you're in their strategy. Something you would know nothing about. Full head of steam now from Spartan. You see, he just ignored me like that. Do you see how disrespectful that is? I mean, when, when a man of many words is usually found in Hook silence inside in, leg, front, two count. in front of royalty. Oh, look at this. Oh, now, now see, what are you going to say? Tell me. He's, ch he's choking him out with his key. But, you know, I, myself, participate in jiu-jitsu, and that is a legal move in jiu-jitsu. You are allowed yeah, to use the This isn't jiu-jitsu. You can this use isn't a mat. Key. This is a ring. This is the squared circle. You don't get to do that here. He was allowed to wear it in the ring if the Spartan all of a sudden, because of his clumsiness and lack of skill, ends up getting caught, in, getting caught up in it. That's his own fault. Exactly. And look, if he's allowed to wear it in the ring, if it was illegal, the ref should tell him to take it off. Am I right? Or am I right? Well, that would be an ultimate sign of disrespect. It would. He's a professor. You know, he's a black belt. Look at that. He's putting his forearm right across the head there. Delivering the painful shots in the middle of the ring. And... Oh, but he has a close fist. You saw that, He Joe. has awakened something within Spartan. And Luis Ramirez... Oh, oh, he wants... Oh! A small taste of vindication with a chop across the chest. Oh, no! The, the king showing some concern. Block. There you go. That's all right. Jesse James got to fight through it. The king is infallible. His subjects are not. Full head of steam runs into the boot. That's right. I mean... Did, Knowing about fallibility is something I learned plenty about sitting next to Joe Galley all these months. Oh, Triangle choke while great, using the ropes for added leverage there. Great He's strategy. He's up to a count of three. Great strategy. He's got to five though, Joe. Yeah, he can count. He, he knows how to count. What do we have here? Look at this. Look at this. This is why I added this man. Look at that. Look at that kick. Big heel kick, not sure if he got all of it, hooking that outside leg two count. Spartan staying alive in this match. You know, if you don't get more enthusiastic out here, I'm gonna give you all of this fist. Yeah, you need to bow down to the king over here. I would have, I honestly, king, I would have dignified Joe Galley's face with even a punch of your fist. You've got, you've got more, you've got more important things to concentrate on. Like the RCW championship Absolutely, tonight. absolutely. And Joe, I'm going to look forward to hearing you call and say it, a new RCW champion, King Love. I can't wait to hear that on a clip. I'm going to love it. We'll see if it can happen. I mean, Mysterious Q, I mean, I have to say, I'm, I'm, I was rather surprised for you to give props to him as being one of the potentially Bye. best RCW hey. champions that we've ever had. He, well, listen, the man went toe-to-toe -to -toe with the NWA World's Champion. He took down Gino Medina, the Intocable, and Gino's a hell of a man himself. I give credit where credit is due. I know I have my work cut out for me tonight, but I'm going to get it done, Joe. All, of, all of Mysterious Q's accolades 
are just what is going to make King Rob Love's victory even more impressive tonight. That's right. That's right. It's going to be a major accomplishment. Big night for me tonight, but it's going to start right here in the ring with Jesse James putting down spot. Double underhook throw immediately into the cover. Shoulders up. James looking to transition now, trapping the bicep. I mean, the Spartan should just save himself the anguish and, and just tap out already. He's, he's getting put through the ringer in so much pain. Jesse James locking in the arm bar. And I think he's saying he gives up. Spartan's mouthing, I give up. He's mouthing something. I mean, these fans are making so much noise. Shoulders are down. Two count, but still holding on to the arm. Again, stacking him up. Two count. I mean, at, at this point, Spartan can only hope for a draw with this time limit. Now, if, Sp if Spartan comes back up on this move, Jesse James can transition from an arm bar into a triangle choke. The arm is in position, so Spartan comes up. He might go into a triangle. See, right there. Look, look. Now he's got the triangle. He's right looking there. for it. Can he get it no, in? His, his shoulders oh, are up, Rev. That was a false count, and I think that threw Jesse James off. That count should not have started, and that really shocked Jesse James and, and threw him off mentally. It did. It did. It, it, that shouldn't have been we've a had, count. We've had way too many referee shenanigans in this... Uh, on this card tonight. That, that's something I need to talk to Brandon Boom Boom Oliver about. It concerns me about the main or my match tonight with uh, Mysterious Key. I'm wondering if I'm going to have some shenanigans with Abs this. Absolutely. Uh, I'd be surprised if you did have some shenanigans in your match, to be quite honest with you. Well, it wouldn't come from me. Never. We don't, I mean, Never. We don't know what Mysterious Q. We don't know what Mysterious Q is capable of. That is not a man of this planet. I wouldn't put it past Q to cheat, though. Sling blade by Spartan, but perhaps the damage is done immediately going back to the left arm. All I know is Jesse James better get it together over here. He's in a world of hurt. I mean, you need that enforcer because, again, Spartan owes you a kiss on the foot. Oh, oh look at this. Key against him. Look at this. Pulling it over his head. Disrespectful. Still trying to fight the key. This malfeasance shouldn't stand. This is ridiculous. Smart it's insulting the black belt. Up on two the shoulders. With two minutes left in this time of matchup. Oh, Spartan looked like that. Neck breaker came down hard. Two count. That neck breaker looked like it, it hurt Spartan's arm when he was coming down as well. He might have taken some of the brunt of that force. Oh, and now he's just oh, using it, yes. using the key and choking the life out of him. Turnabout's fair play. Get the key out of the ring. Turnabout's fair play. Spartan used it just a minute ago, and now all of a sudden, Jesse James can't? What a hypocrite. Into the cover, hooks the outside leg, two count. I'm, I'm, I'm waiting to, I didn't hear you try to shame Spartan when he was using the key. He wasn't oh, you were using all, it as you a were weapon. All over, he wasn't you were using all it as a over weapon. Jesse James yeah, when, Jesse, when he was Spartan using, wasn't it, using it to when choke Spartan somebody just as a happened, when Spartan weapon. just happened to get oh caught gosh. up into it. This argument oh, between but, us is doing nothing for the Spartan. fans watching our title match. As he falls face first into the canvas. Whoa, oh, kick oh, to the face. And here comes the king. The king is off the headset. Where is he going? He's pulled the referee. God. Again, again, pulls Nick nope. Morton off of the apron. I, I, I don't blame Luis him the Ramirez way. Luis should have won this match. I don't blame him the way the Spartan I clearly am cheated. I pistol right now. Clearly, this is ridiculous. The Spartan clearly cheated earlier in this match. I can't oh, say I blame him. Oh, stud stash. Stud stash, what is he doing here? Oh, a huge lariat. Remaining. 30 seconds remaining. Carolina oh, no. team Come answering on. the warning, and now... Jesse James gets the three count. Unbelievable. A victory for the king and his royal subject. Give it up for our winner of round two, Jesse James. And it looks like the king has not only a successful right hand man, but maybe a new left hand man. Stud Stash coming in with the save. This was a three-on-one attack. This is absolutely ridiculous. I don't understand how people can keep getting away with this type of stuff here. And now I gotta listen to the king. All right, all right. How about that victory?
All right. Oh, yeah! Well earned. What a victory. Oh, dream. yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Shut up, you peasants! This right here is the dawning of a new era, new beginnings. This is the River City Kingdom welcoming the stunt stash to RCW. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Tonight, the RCW Championship is coming home where it belongs when I defeat Mysterious Q. Oh, yeah! Let me hear you cheer for your king! You know what? The king needs his crown and cape. Oh, oh, really? You're gonna go? Okay, well, now I've lost Handsome Javi. Ladies and gentlemen, it's just me, and Javi has left. He's got the cape now. As we now have seen a, a growing faction here with King Rob Love, Jesse James, and now Stud Stash, a formidable team, to say the least. Oh, I guess he didn't want his crown. Well, maybe he just doesn't want to get it all sweaty before his big introduction for his uh, match is coming up there. I mean, any time you can help out a regal man like himself, like the King Rob Love, you got to do it. Sometimes I'm so disappointed by you, Bobby. It's I mean, just, it's uh, just disappointing. I mean, that's an improvement. I'm always disappointed in you, Joe Galley. So anyway. Ladies and gentlemen, 